Tonight, San Diego County officials are considering analytic technology to tackle the homelessness crisis. Tomorrow, the Board of Supervisors will consider a proposal that includes technology that could help predict who will become homeless. CBSA's Jasmine Ramirez explains how it would work. The technology is already being used by Major League Baseball teams to help them win games. Now, San Diego County is hoping to use it to help prevent people from becoming homeless. That is one for 15 in the postseason. Corks this one down the line. Baseball teams use data to predict how players will perform, analyzing things like pitching, hitting, and fielding to give teams a winning edge. The county is hoping to use a similar analytic technology to predict who is on the cusp of homelessness. Someone may owe the county money. Uh, they may uh, have been arrested. They may have come to our psych hospital. The combination of these factors points us to them having a high probability of, of, of being at high risk of homelessness. I think it's really great that the county is thinking about this. Joanne Stanley is the executive director of Housing for the Homeless. She believes the intention is good, but says other methods might work better. We are so short in actual services and things that we can offer to people. It feels like actually making that more robust. People are reaching out all the time. The county also announced a new app. It would be used by county employees who often interact with the homeless. These are workers, our parks folks, our librarians. They may not be dedicated uh, homeless outreach folks, but they do encounter those. And how do we help them uh, get that information and data into our county system so we can engage with these folks? Here's a look at the app. Let's say a librarian spoke with someone experiencing homelessness. The librarian could pin the library and log information about the person to help connect them with services. These new homeless prevention efforts will go before the Board of Supervisors for approval at tomorrow's meeting. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.